Hi, I'm Dr. Lauren Rickards. I'm from the Climate Change Transformations Group at RMIT University. And this is my message from the future. Today, we think about the future a lot. We realise that we need to understand not only that the future is uncertain, but that we have a lot of control over it. We take that responsibility to carve out positive future pathways really seriously. We've also come to recognise how interconnected things are. That old idea that environmental impacts are externalities, that's considered very weird. And that's partly because the social sciences are at the heart of the research and practice of today's society. We realise that they help us to think about how we think and that we've had to really recheck and revisit some of our old assumptions. And that's how we've managed to get onto a positive pathway, realising that we need to alter some of our very basic paradigms. So while things are pretty hard at present, there's no denying that, we have made a lot of headway. Think back, I remember, to the present that you are in. I remember those days of deep social inequalities, ecological catastrophes, disregard for younger and older generations and other species. Well, we've woken up to the folly of that and in dismantling the fossil fuel regime and reducing disaster risk, we've learnt a lot and achieved a lot of other things. So while it's certainly true that today we do have some difficult climatic conditions, thanks to the climate change that was locked into the Earth system back in your day, and I would urge you to reduce those as soon as possible to help make a massive difference to your future lives, now we've actually realised that doing that is not just about the emissions. We've also realised that reducing disaster risk is not just about reducing climatic risk. It's about addressing deep social vulnerabilities and all these things are interconnected. One of the differences is that we've all become researchers. We've all learned that we need to have a learning orientation to the world. We've all learned how to avoid emissions and avert cascading impacts. And in doing so, we've learned a lot of other things about the world. Well, we've learned, of course, to value more the wisdom of Indigenous Australians about how to care for this continent. We've learnt about the wonders of soil, plants, water bodies and how much we can achieve when we actually work together as diverse communities. So hold on to your hats. You've got some tricky years ahead of you but common sense and an ethic of care will prevail and we will learn together how to make the world a safe and better place.